What's up guys? In this tutorial, I will show you how to fix the problem when your controller is not connecting or not working properly on your Windows PC. First, open up your Windows settings by searching for it in your Start menu and pressing Enter. If you're trying to connect a Bluetooth controller, navigate to the Bluetooth and Devices section. Make sure Bluetooth is enabled on your PC. Then, put your controller into pairing mode. For example, if you're using a PS5 controller, press and hold the Create button and the PS button at the same time until the light bar starts blinking. This indicates that the controller is in pairing mode. Next, click Add Device in the Bluetooth settings. If your controller was previously connected, it might still appear in the list of paired devices. In that case, click on the menu button for your controller and select Remove Device. After doing this, select Add a Bluetooth device again. Your controller should appear in the list of available devices. Select it and your controller should connect successfully. If your controller doesn't show up or isn't connecting, try running the Bluetooth Troubleshooter. To do this, go to Settings, System, Troubleshoot, Other Troubleshooters. Here, find and run the Bluetooth Troubleshooter. This tool will diagnose and resolve common Bluetooth issues. Wait a few seconds for the troubleshooter to complete the process. If you're not using a Bluetooth controller or the problem persists, try connecting your controller using a USB cable. Even if your controller supports Bluetooth, using a direct USB connection can sometimes resolve connectivity problems. Once the controller is connected, open Device Manager. To do this, search for Device Manager in your Start menu and hit Enter. In the Device Manager window, expand Mice and Other Pointing Devices. Right-click on this section and select Scan for Hardware Changes. This will prompt Windows to recognize your recently connected controller. Afterward, locate your controller in the Device Manager list. Right-click on it and select Update Driver. Choose the option to search automatically for drivers. Wait for Windows to search online and download the latest driver software for your controller. Once completed, your controller should work properly. To ensure your controller is recognized in games or applications, Check the settings within those platforms. For Steam games, open the Steam Launcher and click on Steam in the top left corner to access the settings. In the Controller section, you will see if your controller is detected. Click Begin Test to open a new window and confirm that all buttons and joysticks on your controller are functioning correctly. Additionally, you can toggle the Enable Steam Input option for your controller in the same settings menu. This can improve compatibility for some games. To fine-tune your controller for specific games, go to your Steam library. Right-click the game you want to play and select Properties. In the Controller section, you can adjust the input settings to ensure your controller works as intended. Finally, after completing all of these steps, it's recommended to restart your PC. Restarting applies all changes and ensures your controller setup is fresh and functional. I hope this helped you out. Leave a comment if you have any questions and see you in the next one.